Welcome back to Dare to Call Him Friend, and here's part two of the two-part series, and the title today is Flipping the Coin a Little Bit, I Can't, or I'm Too Afraid. I love reading Old Testament heroic tales because they usually highlight God's ability to use less than perfect people. At their point of commissioning, God encourages his recruits with a wonderful promise. Do not fear. The Lord your God goes before you. Even cynical Gideon understood the message. God could if Gideon would. I long to be used by God to make a positive impact on the world around me. And yet, all too often, I find the following words coming out of my mouth. I can't help you. I can't help myself. I can't do that. I couldn't possibly even consider. I can't even dream that I'd ever. I'm afraid that if I help you, I'll not have time for myself. And yet, God is my strength. I choose to step out in faith and trust him to give me wisdom in budgeting my time so I have the energy to do all that God would ask of me. I'll trust that my cup will never run dry as I give to others from his abundance. I'm afraid that I'll never conquer this reoccurring sin in my life. And yet, I choose to believe that in my weakness, I am made strong through him. I'm afraid that if I make a stand for Jesus, I will be ridiculed. And yet, Jesus was mocked and humiliated for speaking the truth. I'll take the risk of being seen a fool for the sake of his gospel. I'm afraid that if I lay down my own plans and agendas, then I'll not have a firm foundation on which to stand. And yet, Christ is my firm foundation. I'll trust him to lead me when I follow him, even if he leads me in unknown territory. I'm afraid to dream again, as so many of my dreams have been crushed. And yet, I serve the God of the second and third chances. I serve the God of Abraham and Moses. I am the friend of the God who encourages me to dream big and works with me to see those dreams come true. So today, let the words of your mouth reflect the condition of your heart because that is a precise place that God can begin to do mighty works in your life and through your life.